Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. Who signs power of attorney? A power of attorney POA is a legal document. It allows one person to act on behalf of another. The person granting the power is known as the principal. The individual given the authority is called the agent or attorney in fact. To create a valid POA, specific steps must be followed. First, the principal must be of sound mind. This means they must understand the powers they are granting. The principal must also be at least 18 years old. The POA document must be signed by the principal. The signature must be voluntary and not coerced. In most jurisdictions, the principal's signature must be notarized. This means a notary public must witness the signing. The agent does not need to sign the POA document. However, it is good practice for the agent to acknowledge their duties. This can be done by signing an acknowledgement form. Some states require witnesses for the signing of a POA. Typically, two witnesses are needed. The witnesses must be impartial and not related to the principal or agent. Once signed, the POA document should be stored safely. The principal should inform the agent where it is kept. The agent may need to present the document to third parties to act on the principal's behalf. A POA can be specific or general. A specific POA grants limited powers while a general POA grants broad authority. The principal decides the scope of the agent's powers. A POA can be revoked by the principal at any time. The revocation must be in writing and communicated to the agent. The principal should also inform any third parties relying on the POA. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.